Lock clutching. When you fall, or are hit off the side of an island, and place a block on the side of the island to stop you falling into the void. Is no as, block clutching. In this video, we are mainly gonna focus on ender pearl clutching. I'm gonna be going over, what exactly is pearl clutching. How to pearl clutch. Some common mistakes that people make. And at last, how to practice pearl clutching. But before we go ahead, if you are new here, then a sub to the channel would be greatly appreciated. Also, shout out to Added Solid for being the first Mr. Beast tier channel member. Their channel will be linked in the description, so make sure to check out their channel. Also shout out to these amazing people for being a channel member. If you want to help me financially and get access to cool perks such as a shout out and I friending you on Hive, then you can become a channel member by clicking the join button or link in the description. So, what exactly is pearl clutching? I know, I said something very complex in the beginning of the video. Let me simplify it, so basically, if you are falling to your death, you have an ender pearl, you throw it on the wall of an island, you look down, select blocks from your hotbar, and place a block below you, and that block saves your life. Now as you know, what pearl clutching is, let's head over to how to pearl clutch. So first up, you must learn to arrange your hotbar, and stick with it, eventually as you play, you'll develop muscle memory. As for me, I keep blocks just next to ender pearls, but I do not recommend copying not only my, but anyone's hotbar arrangement. As you play, keep experimenting and find what's perfect for you. Now let's suppose you get knocked off, instead of throwing it blindly anywhere, you should look for a flat surface, and throw the pearl, as soon as you throw it, instantly look down and select blocks from your hotbar, and start tapping below you. And if everything goes perfectly fine, you'll end up clutching. Okay, so now you know how to pearl clutch, now let's look at how you can practice, and yes, you will have to practice, because practice makes a man perfect. To practice pearl clutching, you have two options. Number 1, Pata Skywars Laboratory. It's the best practice map so far, recently Pata updated the map, and made it even better. You can easily practice pearl clutching there. Number 2, Hive Custom Servers. As now anyone can make custom servers, you can make a Treasure Wars custom server, select the map castle, as it has flat walls, making it a really good map to practice pearl clutching. Now let's talk about common mistakes that people make. One thing I have noticed, a lot of people start to panic as they are falling in void, which leads to their death. So try not to panic, it's just a game after all. Also don't be that sweaty type of guy, who somehow ends up clutching somewhere, they literally can clutch on the map ruby, I have seen people play like there's no tomorrow. Anyways back to the topic, another mistake that a lot of people make is, after they throw the pearl, and slide their screen to look down, they accidentally open their inventory, and after you open your inventory it's over. It can be avoided, by sliding the screen vertically down from the center of the screen. Also don't be stupid, and throw the pearl in sky, this is just common sense. At last I just wanna say, don't clutch with crumbling cobblestone or else, 